Hey y'all, welcome to episode 47. On today's episode, we're gonna take a look at how to sharpen your blade and also create a double bevel. And then we are gonna also learn how to take the blade off and replace it when it is time to do so. So everything that you're about to see is approved by the mechanics over at Leather Machine Company, and this is how they sharpen and get everything set up before it's shipped off to you guys. So let's take a look. All right, so the only tool that you are gonna need for sharpening your Skyver blade is this grindstone stick. To begin, turn your blade speed to 4500, which is the highest speed available. Unlatch the sharpening stone lever and engage the foot pedal. Now that the blade is spinning at max speed, once you start this process, you do not stop until it is finished. You want to slowly turn the sharpening stone position knob by bringing it towards the blade. You want the stone engaged to the blade enough to have the sparks coming out of the machine about 8 inches. Don't worry about the sparks, they won't hurt you or cause any damage to the machine. You will let this sharpening stone grind away on the blade until the sparks are reduced and then you will engage the stone again towards the blade by turning the knob to repeat this process. Once the sparks have reduced for the second time, move the sharpening stone away from the blade. Now you will see the blade as a beautiful fresh single bevel. So we are going to add a second bevel which allows you to skive thinner and smoother. Start by turning the blade position handle and move the blade one quarter of an inch away from the presser foot. Engage the foot pedal again and slowly bring the sharpening stone back to the blade. This time you want the sparks to only reach about three to five inches. Once the sparks have started to diminish, grab your grindstone stick and you want to place it against the inside of the blade for 10 seconds. Do not press hard on this. This is just a gentle process and you are simply removing any burrs on the inside of the blade. Finally, back the sharpening stone away from the blade and you are all done. And there you have it, a perfect double beveled and freshly sharpened Skyver blade. All right, now let's go over the process on how to change out the blade if you want to replace the entire unit itself. Start by removing the side plate and unhooking the spring-loaded pressure lever. Loosen the black handle center pin screw and pull the roller bracket center arm pin away. Now you can remove the entire roller bracket arm carefully. Unscrew the waste feeder knob and carefully remove and set aside. Next, screw in the knife cover remover tool to remove this cover, you want to pull and move the tool back and forth until the cover becomes unseated. There are four knife set screws that you need to remove. Please be careful and diligent because these screws are very tight and you are now putting pressure towards the blade and you don't want to slip and get cut by the blade. Move the sharpening stone all the way back so you have room to remove the blade. Now gently wiggle and unseat the blade until it comes off. The important key indicator to know when it is time to change your blade is when you have worn through half of the actual blade. Take your new blade and insert it back into the machine. Make sure the four mounting holes line up with the blade. Now begin the process of putting all the knife set screws back into place along with the blade cover. Yeah. 
waist feeder goes back on, and finally, we have to reassemble your roller bracket arm, and then you have completed changing out the blade on your Skyver. Now carefully insert the roller bracket arm back into place and line all the pins back up and push them into place. This roller bracket center arm pin has a flat side and that should be facing outwards because this allows the center pin screw to lock it in place. Now to check everything, the center arm pivots like normal and make sure that there is absolutely no back and forth movement or sliding of the arm. Alright, that's it for today you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this information has helped you and that you're going to be able to sharpen your blade on your Skyver properly. Alright, take care and I'll see you on next week's episode.